Boynton Beach has become world famous for underwater marine life. Many divers and snorkelers refer to Boynton Beach as the 10th wonder of the world. The Boynton Beach Community Redevelopment Agency heard that close to 70% of the kids in the state of Florida did not know how to swim, including a large percentage living in the Boynton Beach area. The Boynton Beach CRA offered to partner with the City of Boynton Beach Recreation and Parks Department, working with kids from the Camp Division, the Palm Beach County Parks and Recreation Department, and Project Seahorse, a nonprofit organization that teaches kids swimming and snorkeling instruction that introduces them to an amazing world under the sea. The Boynton Beach CRA understood the importance of this project, recognizing the Boynton Harbor Marina as an important component to the program. The Boynton Harbor Marina is located a half mile south of the Boynton Inlet, which offers a multitude of water activities, including scuba diving and snorkeling charters. To prepare for the snorkeling experience, the children worked very hard on the three Mondays before the special field trip, being taught how to swim with snorkel gear. Hi, my name is Jonathan Dickinson. Um, I work for a company called Florida Freedivers. Uh, we sell and we educate people on freediving equipment. We get everyone to kind of enjoy this underwater world without the hassle of dealing with scuba tanks. So uh, I had uh, two groups. Uh, the Sharks are a group of kids who have really kind of honed in some of the skills, but they're still needing some polishing. So we played some games trying to see who could go the furthest and who could touch as many tiles and uh, every all the while using the buddy system and making sure that you know as that person surfaces there's someone else there waiting for them on the surface and the second group I got to work with was the uh, the flying fish uh, not as advanced as the sharks but we're working towards it so making sure that we can keep our masks and snorkels on our face and swim a distance without picking our head up out of the water so it's a really exciting time to be able to teach these kids kind of some, ex, you know, getting more experience in the water with a confined environment so that tomorrow when we go in the ocean, we'll actually be able to see those skills come to fruition. The collaboration was a perfect match, combining the dive and snorkel charters with the Project Seahorse program, which gave the kids an opportunity of a lifetime to snorkel and free dive the marine resources right off the Boynton Beach shores. On July 28th, the kids boarded Splashdown Divers, Loggerhead Dive Charters, and Calypso of the Palm Beaches at the Boynton Harbor Marina with certified instructors from Florida Free Divers, City Lifeguards, and City staff. They were off to snorkel the Loftus, a Norwegian historic shipwreck which sank in 1898, about 200 yards offshore of the Boynton Beach coast. What was it like for you? It, it was fun and scary. Um, it was fun because I've never done this before, and it was scary because I've never done this before. Awesome. What were you surprised that you could do? Um, swim by myself, um, and that I could swim over the fish without going back. How did you like um, swimming with the fish? What did you see? Um, I saw different fish. Um, thankfully none of them were big. Well, it felt like swimming with the fishes, but I wasn't actually swimming with the fishes. They were on the bottom. And it's a pretty good program to teach you how, how to snorkel. I'm going to tell my mom I had lots of fun and I'm glad I get to keep, keep doing Keep snorkeling. Awesome, awesome. Do awesome. you think you'd like to bring your mom out here to snorkel with you? Maybe. Alright. Yeah. 
people from all over the world come to Boynton Beach to dive and snorkel the many reefs and shipwrecks off the shore of Boynton Beach. This opportunity will pave the way for children to understand and embrace this wonderful available resource in their own backyard. And they will direct their energies toward a better future for themselves and for Boynton Beach. Project Seahorse showed the campers and their families how amazing our beaches and reefs are and why it is important to learn how to swim.